or go to TCM.com. Yes, there are thousands in our family. Their work is an integral part of what will be the best picture of the year and of every picture of every year. The award that is about to be given then is a tribute to each and every one of them. The best motion picture is... Hi, I'm Robert Osborne. Right now we're bringing you all five contenders in the Oscar category of best costume design in a color film for the year 1954. Well, our next feature is the winner in that category that year. The Oscar going to costume designer Sanjo Wada for the beautiful work on the Japanese film Gate of Hell. And in addition to winning for best costume design in a color film, Gate of Hell was also awarded an honorary Oscar as the year's best foreign language film. Given as an honorary award because in 1954, the Academy didn't yet have a special category to recognize foreign films as we do today. Gate of Hell is one of the movies actually that helped convince the Academy that an annual award for foreign language films was needed. So that category was added two years later in 1956. As for Gate of Hell, it tells the story of love and passion in the 12th century, and it's filled with rich, gorgeous images that help make it the first Japanese film in color to be widely shown in the West. This less than nine years after the U.S. was fighting Japan in World War II. It's a film of truly epic dimensions, despite it being only 89 minutes long. The film's leading lady is Mashiko Kayo, who you may recognize from the classic Akira Kurosawa film, Rashomon. She also later was Marlon Brando's leading lady in The Tea House of the August Moon. She was, in fact, the first Japanese actress to gain international recognition, and you're about to see why. Here's the film from Japan, and it is dazzling. Gate of Hell. 